a sudden the boost just went, the boost went out of sight. It felt great, but there's no way the engine would live with 100 inches of boost. So. Thank you. Sorry to say, are you out or are you going to try to get back in? Um, I figure all we can do now is have fun, so let Pete go out and have some. Okay, all right. Well, fun for Bobby and Pete, perhaps. That's Pete Halsmer, but frustration for the Ford SBO team who have had consistent problems with this 2.1 liter German built engine. They are now in the midst of making a major change. Earlier, Steve had a look at what's going to happen. The original concept behind the Mustang Probe GTP car was for Ford to design, build, and develop the machine and then sell it to other racing teams, much as Porsche does. Now, the three-piece carbon fiber modular chassis was an immediate hit with the racers. It is really slick. But they remained a little skeptical about the four-cylinder turbocharged 2.1 engine. While there's been rumors for some time that Ford might fit one of the probes with their Indy-style Ford Cosworth DFX engine. Well, we can confirm that rumor. There it sits right here at Road America. Now, at Indianapolis, that would be a 2.6 liter engine. Here with EMSA rules, it's 2.1 with twin turbochargers. There's no numbers on the car, so they haven't entered it, but they do plan to test here Monday and Tuesday after the race. A number of teams have already expressed interest in buying one of these cars. Now, the price, near as we can figure from Ford, is $350,000. Now, that's without air conditioning, vinyl roof, or a sound system. Now, I did a little figuring. Now, if they offered five and a half annual percentage rate financing, and you put $100,000 down, your payments would only be be about $2,200 a month for 28 years. Now, as far as insurance is concerned, forget it. <laughs> Would you buy a used car from that man? Oh, more trouble in the Ford Pits. That's the other pro. That's Klaus Ludwig, one of the drivers, looking very disappointed. Down in the cockpit is Tom Gloy. Steve is with him to find out what happened. Tom, the crew appears to be working in the area of the fuel injection. Well, I'm not sure what happened. The car was absolutely superb at the start, and uh, unfortunately, I got a whole big hunk of debris in a crash with the uh, BMW and the Chevrolet. And, uh, she ran. I had to make a stop for that, and, and uh, she ran pretty good for a while, but now uh, something's happened in the boost system, and uh, I think it's a little bit of uh, extra debris damage from a, coming up underneath the car. Well, that team is snake but One of these days, they're going to get a ride and win about 20 races in a row. As we watch Scott Pruitt still in a battle with Dennis Ossie and that Toyota Turbo uh, Celica right ahead of him. And, boy, these guys have been going at it all day long, Steve. Well, that's one Ford that can certainly...